So God created man in his own image. In the image of God, he created him, male and female. He created them. Genesis chapter 1, verse 27. More than two decades ago, I realized I was not who I said I was. When I got married more than 40 years ago, I neglected to legally change my name. I was under the mistaken impression that when I surrendered my Indiana driver's license with my maiden name on it and put Bevere on my new Texas license, everything was taken care of. From that day forward, Bevere was the only name I used. Every check I signed, every paycheck I received, any book I authored was under my new surname. When we moved to Florida, I turned in my Texas license under the same assumption. Everything was fine until I went to the DMV for my Colorado license. After an excessively long wait, my name was called. But when I got to the counter, they refused to issue a license because, according to their records, Lisa Bevere didn't exist. A trip to the DMV is challenging on the best of days, but this became the worst. I showed them my passport that had my maiden and married names hyphenated. I assured them there was a mistake, but as far as the DMV was concerned, I didn't exist under either name. Frantic, I explained I'd written books, paid taxes, and been employed under that very name. I handed the woman my Florida license with Bevere as my surname, but to no avail, because according to their records, neither name belonged to me. I stepped aside and burst into tears.